You're listening to the sounds of Salford from the UK going out to the world. Oh, that's the fifth tackle. And uh, Tompkins. Dobson now. Dobson flings the pass. Griffin. Griffin out the side door and Evans is in. (laughs) Niall Evans gets the try. It's right in the corner. Two minutes to go. Evans with his second of the game. Isn't that incredible? They've looked for Nyla Valls two or three occasions when they go down to the to that left edge. And Griffin does a tremendous job there. That's probably the only defensive error that Mins has made in this game when he shows the outside to that man. And when Nyla Valls gets this ball, he's going to score it. Look at that. Perfect play. He's been forced into that defensive misread as well. Missed conversion by O'Brien, there's still a four-point ball game. As he take a look back at that try, last tackle play, the big booming ball from Dobson Sam from off. right to left. And then it was uh, Josh Griffin, the stop and the go, and Thomas Mins forced inwards, forced in because of the movements of Griffin. Love the little sort of pass, and then Evolt's crossing in the corner. Penny for his thoughts. What's this set of six going to be like? Off, fellas, yeah. Every minute matters. That was the mantra. They wanted jeopardy. Well, this minute matters. It's Josh, the final Josh. minute of the, the million-pound game, and there's just four Good. points in it between Hull Kingston Rovers and the Salford Red Devils. Rovers supporters are imploring their side Three. to hold no. out. The Salford fans up the other end of the field willing them towards them. Silvery. They're looking for this flank again. They're looking for Evels. They're looking for Evels. They've got Josh Griffin. Griffin has got Evels. Evels cuts in field and it's cut down by Mins. Five seconds to go. It's with O'Brien. It's with Dobson. It's across the field. Here goes the Hooter. The pass was forward, surely. It's with Johnson. Johnson in the corner. Johnson for the Salford Red Devils. Can't believe it. The Southland supporters cannot believe it. The Rovers supporters can't believe it. Goes to extra time now. If they miss this kick, it goes to extra time. And if you look at the players, the whole team are players, they're not shell shocked. They're absolutely shell shocked. We're a Southland. How they pull that out of the back. The goal to a man in the final stages was Josh Griffin. The try scorer is now the man. He knows he's going to play the ball as quick as he can because Hulkin and the defenders are all coming around the run. They go into where the gap was. And then this long ball from Brad Flanagan. It's a good pass and that's a great finish, Wellesley. It's a lot of work done. To see the reaction of the Salford fans who charge the field as Johnson knocked his ball down. I think mean, they'll look at the last three or four minutes and you look at the contribution of Josh Griffin. Who will have pleased that man no end? What pressure on Gareth O'Brien. This to keep Salford in Super League. And consign Hawkins to Rovers to the championship. And O'Brien misses. The Hooter sounds. 18 points apiece. And it's golden points extra time. As the uh, coin toss to decide who'll play which way in this golden points extra time. And they will turn around and think now that Gareth O'Brien lining up his conversion. And there you can see the bottle thrown onto the pitch. The soccer players unhappy about that. Absolutely everything into this set of six defensively. Trying to 
come up with a shot. Trying to make that happen. Trying to make sort of play. But they made the mistake. Who would it be? Michael Dobson. Will he return to haunt his former club? He's picked, kicked plenty of drop goals in his career. Terry Cantese. Every second, every decision so important. Salford won the toss and chose to receive possession. Well, I think that answers your question about where, where the momentum lies on. Who feels like they have the momentum? Get the ball in the hands. They've got first shot. First. Move. Was looking for somebody there, and there was nobody on his shoulder, so he took the tackle. Two, and move, Mitch. Rovers will be looking to keep to to this end of the field. Don Lennon within range. Robert Louis. Ben Bird up the The Old Nags Head in Earlham sponsors the morning show on the sounds of Salford. Hi, good morning and welcome to Straight From The Fan's Mouth with Dennis Robbins Riley. How are you, mate? I'm all right, pal. I'm on top I'll of the what? world. What's them blues you say to say to you, mate? Oh, well, that was my charity boxing. I will go into that in a minute, right, mate. Right. We? So, yeah, we'll go into that in a little bit, pal. But, yeah, well, let's, get always... let's get back to the uh, rugby, right. shall we? Friday evening, f- Friday first evening. half. What can you say? How good was that? I've not seen rugby like that. Before. I've never seen it. Never. Best especially, I've ever felt in my life. Especially off a Salford team. You know what I mean? I can understand people who watch Wigan and Saints, you know, for years. Yeah. That's the sort of rugby what they've probably been playing. That's why they're successful. And if we carry on the way we are with this, mate, I, it was just breathtaking. It was just the way, the speed, of the way he was playing the yeah. ball, really, wasn't it? Yeah. Going through loads of sets of hands and yeah. the way he was running the I tackles. Just, I just felt like when I was watching the game, when they went 8 nil up, yeah. our team just looked as though they say, right, is that all you've got? Yeah, is that it? And then stepped it up it, two or three years. That was the start, wasn't it? I, I understand that they had four decent players missing. Don't like, but you, got look, a, you can only beat what's in front of you. Correct, right? But you've got a big squad, so it's yeah. up to the coach how he uses the squad. Right? They took a lead, yeah, yeah. and we murdered them. Yeah. The word you're looking for is tear the new bum bum. We annihilated them. back your hat. We annihilated them. <laughs> and it's the best I've ever seen. Well, ever. You, you, you've got to put your hands up and you've got to hold your hands up and, and give Ian Watson his due again because he got his tactic bang on yet again. Yeah, again, yeah. You know yeah, what again. I mean? And, Great you know, coach of the year so far for me. Well, he's, we're up there within second, mate. Second, and, uh, second. Does it sound think, right? We're second, mate. Well, yeah, it does sound right for me, in yeah, a way. Because I, I called this out on the others field at the whole friendly, remember? Yeah. And I said to you, we, when I watched that friendly, I know people, oh, it's only a friend, but I could see Hull are a great team. Yeah. Yeah. And we, we battered them in the friendly and we battered them in the game. Yeah, we did. We did. You know we what did. I mean? We we're did. the only team to beat Castleford. <coughs> yeah. Wigan were lucky because we were under strength. Yeah. We, yeah, yeah. we played that. Wakefield, we should have beat them. That, 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 that was a game what we lost. Yeah, we lost that one. And at the, the last second. Was a draw, wasn't it? Do you know Five what I mean? Lead. So if you look at the bigger picture on, on our rugby. We're gonna be. We're gonna have a good say this year, mate. Yeah, we're gonna be there. All Positive, right, and and I, and I do believe, I do believe, there's a massive buzz around the place. Yeah. Well, we've got competition for places every yeah. place in it. Yeah. If you look at uh, Logan Tompkins, yeah. who not a lot of people rave about, but I quite like him. He's You've been got brilliant, brilliant, haven't you? He's been brilliant. Brilliant, has not he? They've all been brilliant. You can't, you can't, you can't turn around and say, "Oh, he's played." You've got Robbie Lewis playing out of his skin. Yep. Yeah. You've got Dobbo. He's, he's just the start of the season for me this well, year. The general, yeah, the general, he's, he's bossing it all about. 
Gazzy's playing well. They're all playing well, aren't they? The yeah. forwards are doing the year donkey work. Flanagan, again, Flanagan's playing well. Flanagan's having a belting season. You know. They all are, though, aren't they? You go Off through bit. them forwards. Ben. George scoring past his brother again. Yeah, again. That's yeah. two out of two for him. So that's how to run, that, uh, run the ball, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. See the way they run it. Yeah. You run that ball. He yeah. took that pass off. Uh, I think it was Dobson. Boom. It's brilliant. I can't, I can't fault us, mate. I really can't. Even when they come back all in the second half, he still sends so for Will point out, I didn't you? I said, I said to, to Barrett, I went, they're going to go in there at half time. They're going to get a bollocking off the coach, so they're going to come at us. Yeah. Gonna, it's natural, they're at home. And then we took the storm, we let him score. Well, we didn't let him score, but they scored again. And then what did we do? Boom. Yeah, we've been doing it all over. Do you know what I mean? And then that, you know, it was it was a result that <laughs> it's a result that you nearly got right, mate. And you were nearly going to follow them. <laughs> talk about that but, in a minute, can't we? Ah, it is. Hey, tell you what, it was only four off. I did say, I did say fifty-eight. I'm sorry about that. For anyone that like that. <laughs> but yeah, you, you, I can't, I can't fault that. But we'll go into that in a bit. But no, I, I just thought again, the team spirit was right. Yeah, and the fans were amazing. Fans now you were right at the top, weren't you? How was oh, your heart? <laughs> no, mate. Did you see the walk? Hey. When I got to the top of them It was like being at Old Trafford, would it? Well, it was worse, mate. When I got to the top of that box, I nearly collapsed, mate. I bet you did. It was like in shape of tensing. <laughs> That's what it felt like, some mountain here. I've hey. never been so high in my life. We'll keep you away from me hey. and Watson. Get up where. the world looking <laughs> down on creation. Hey. That's what I felt. I was in the clouds. Yeah. Yeah. Was it good though? Was it a good view? Brilliant view, yeah. It's brilliant view. How is it going, the old... Um... Well, I've been in four press boxes now and we've won four games. Oh, so you better get in there on Catalans, have you? have got to do the live updates you now, got, you know. Yeah, you got to do something. Oh, yeah. I know it affects everyone's phone, beeping. So this this is the uh, big weekend this weekend where there's two games. We've got, Lee, we've got Lee on the Friday, so if you've not got your ticket, listen to me. I'm going to tell you this once and once only. Use people who can't be arsed getting off your frigging asses because it's uh, it's not the willows anymore, right? You're just a waste of specimen. No. You, you, you're missing out on I it. Absolutely. Out there, do you know what I mean? You, I, you, I want the come away fans to come back. You're absolutely missing a fantastic team when who, you, deserve, yeah. who deserve great support. When I'm you telling can, you, Simon, you can see you, they, they, they're sick of the old excuse now. Oh, it's not the willows. I'm not the Forget it. It's gone. This is a win. Don't miss team, out. Man. Don't miss out on a great team. This is a winning You're team. seeing some rugby. You're seeing some rugby what you probably never see before in your life. Never I, see again. I people, I was talking to team. people who've been going so for 30, 40 years and they've never seen anything I like have, it. Same with never. Me. I've been going never. since I was a little kid and I've never seen that like this. You know, and I thought the team in the 70s was good. It probably One was, Simon. It probably all, was. But you I, don't know. Think, I think this, this team can match him. This is, this is just up there with, with the best. Yeah, the best time You're not seen. second in the league for nothing. No. You, you don't, don't beat Castleford who's top for nothing. No, you don't get there by yeah. a fluke. You're on the top, really. Connect, you don't go to Hull and smash him on their own backyard, do you? Put 54 past him. People you know what laughed I mean? at me when I said And 15. it should have been, how many conversions did we miss? That's where I go out wrong. I'm blaming Gaz. <laughs> <laughs> I think we missed, was it three or four conversions? Could have been 62, couldn't it? There you go, mate. So, you know what I mean? So, they were very, very lucky. Yeah. You know, but you know, I'm saying to people, come on down and support these boys. They need your support. There's no excuses. They've got great deals on at the club. Anyone's got any issues about they can't afford it, whatever, just get in touch with the club. Get in touch with Ian Blees. Have a chat with him. See if he can do you some offers down there. Right? Because this club really does need the fans now. Because yeah. they're playing the rugby. But I've heard people say, oh, it's same old Salford, same this. This is not the same old Salford, no, I'm afraid. Not, it's not. I'm afraid you're this barking up the wrong tree, this mate. This is one of the best teams I've ever seen. You, you see, you, you. see, if you've not been and you've not missed out, you, you, you're missing... You're missing I've, seen, I've seen the shite. The team yeah. spirit. Yeah, never seen nothing like it. Yeah. We've got, we got, we got a Salford coach. You've got to look at it this way. We've got a Salford uh, CEO. Yeah. We've got Salford people involved in Salford. Which is what you want. Isn't okay, it? Care, they might people know. might not like the, the way the things are at the minute, but it doesn't matter off the field. It matters what on the field what counts, and on the field we are hundred and ten percent right. It's as simple as that. Yeah, Couldn't I don't care more. what I don't care what the other people doing off the field about marketing the club. Not interested in that bit. That's their job. That's nothing to do with us yeah. as fans. We want to see rugby. We want to see great rugby. Want, and that is what we are all seeing. All we've ever craved for is a winning team, and Correct. we've got one now. Or a team that gives hundred and ten percent, and that's what's been for the shirt. Yeah. Yeah, I can't, I can't see us uh, what's it, in these next two games. I cannot see us losing. No. Three games. We've got Witness the following week at home. And then we've got Toronto, so four games. We, we, look, 
this is the, this is going to be it, Simon. This is a good test for Ian Watson and yeah. the lads. This is where it's going to count. Yeah. This is where he's got to uh, use his squad wisely, and I think he will. Uh, we've got no injuries, well, apart from Brinning. Uh, I believe Weller will be back in a couple of weeks. 